we we are back in Delta Worlds. We've provided with Ellie. I almost forgot her name. I didn't read it. I knew it. Ah, I guess two to three parts, probably three or four of this DLC are left. Then I'm maybe retrying the final boss fight. But yeah, then this let's play is done and finished. It's not a permadev anymore. It's not a permadev anymore. Also, this was this is recorded right before Trepank or Trepank 2 comes out. So I need to make room on my hard drive masses day. Right dash with flock. Hope the job's coming along well. No sign of the constable, which really makes me more nervous. One package of questionable goods delivered and signed for. Excellent. Let's divvy up the payment three ways and we can consider this matter settled. Or we can do it two ways. Three ways? I did all the work while you and your... You and yours sat around. You're lucky to get anything. Give 10,000 bits. What? That ain't gonna be enough to get Cass out of prison. And it ain't what we agreed to. Ah, shit. Looks like it was wrong to assume you were just like Hawthorne after all. But sure hope I can figure something out to pay Cass's fine. Uh, the sheriff is dead. Just chill bay to ride if you... Okay. Map region to my right and to my left so i hope the gods don't attack me because i killed them <laughs> if there are any gods left that is timeline discrepancy detected nearby some privacy please ah oh, god damn it damn it transmission endpoint discovered the receiver in this book matches the transmitter to the listening device found in Cedric's office. Mm. It's somewhat grime covered. What is grime actually? How long has it been on the ground? Please don't taste the dirt this time. Based on the accumulated mix of sludge and detritus, the receiver has been present since approximately a week before Helen's death. Uh, any clues as to what as to who put it there. Due to the high level of foot traffic in this area, this unit is unable to determine who placed the device. Oh shit. No clues. <clears throat> Privacy, Pavati. Privacy. Okay, I got XP for my privacy. Yeah, this is very much the detective zone. I can't go in there, otherwise they're gonna try to kill me again. And they will regret it. Maybe there's some fighting in here. Wouldn't be nice. Oh. You're on for a fight. No, that's not right. That's not right. That's not the saying, right? Are you on for a fight? Hi hmm. there. Sorry, this area is off limits to port vision... Oh, wait half a second. You're the inspector. Sorry about that. I'll buzz you right in. I need to real. I need to look that up. I need Feel to look to that up. Around, I need to look that up. Du, 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 du. Pop, pop. Nope, wrong. Hello, Ellie. Translate. I. You on for a fight? Ich gehe in Kampfbereit. <laughs> ich gehe in Kampfbereit. Uh, it's I not the right. No, it's not the right saying. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ich sehne mich nach einen Kampf. A launch for battle ready. Nah. Nah, it's not the right thing. <laughs> Anyways. Anyways, let's not waste too much time. Ah. <laughs> hey, do you think they keep any spare parts down here? Just wondering. You, you want me to say something for you? Private. Oh, more toilets. Water. 
Brother. It's not dead though. It's not dead. Dead. I don't need I don't need to loot anything anymore. Let's just get XP. Um Hello again. You? We're in the future of sublight. Just you wait and see. Sure. Whatever makes you feel better. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hello. Oh and you big boy. Oh boy. Oh yeah. That's the perfect screenshot. Let's turn the HUD off and... Uh, hello. Thanks, Pavadi. Thanks for posing for me. I appreciate it. Let's take another one. There, yeah, just for good measure. Ah, oh, perfect screenshot. I got my thumbnail. Thank you. Is it is it that thing? No, damn it, not again. Is it that thing that I need to scan? The biology of this sprat is highly unusual. This sprat has been in contact with multiple parasites, yet shows no symptoms of infection. Medical sprats do have highly adaptive immune systems, they like the cockroaches of obsidians, other worlds. An excellent point, Inspector. The unique immunological subsystem found in sprats is advantageous in fending off parasites, pathogens, and other biological threats. Why is this spread so big? A cursory analysis of this organism's anatomy suggests it was bred deliberately for its unusually large size. Oh, we could eat that, you know, we have a food shortage. What would anyone want? An unusually large spread for... Based on slug records of board-issued punitive sanctions against sublight salvage and shipping, this sprat is most likely intended for cage fighting. Uh -huh. They better eat it afterwards. They better eat it. But we're not here for the spread, right? You're being absurd, Spratt. Did you see the new one they shipped in this week? Now that is a sprat of unusual size. Had a crazy look in its eyes, too. You have a crazy look in your eyes. Sublight Underground takes care of its own. There, there is a way up. That's what I'm missing. Oh, a workbench XP. Let's see. Nope, don't need you repaired. Nope, nope, nope. Why not? How much money? Oh no. I'm not getting paid enough. Just like on YouTube. Because I'm still not getting monetization from YouTube. Damn it. I need a thousand subs. Don't check the loot. You, Ella. You're the inspector, aren't you? Baskin Cannon said you'd be by about the cargo that's been going missing. Gosh, this is so neat. A real life inspector. What's that like? Have you solved any mysteries yet? Ever had to shoot a suspect? I'm more of a killer than an inspector. I call it closing a case, and it's the best part of the job. <gasps> case. Mm. Just like a real inspector. Right, so the missing cargo. How can I help your investigation? You're not the brightest, huh? That's why I keep you around. Good workers. Those kind of people who has access to the cargo. Everyone here at Freight Storage and Processing, for a start. Thing is, the cargo is going missing before the shipments even get to the warehouse. Best I can figure, it's probably getting lost in the shipping yard. As for who has access there, Benton Chan, he's the shipping yard manager. He told me it's mainly just the loading automex that handle cargo. I didn't listen. Yeah, I built that statement. The smarter you are, the more advantage you find uh, can find to take your job advantage of. And I feel like I butchered the sentence. The more advantage you take of your job, I feel like you find more ways to take advantage. Could Benton have anything to do with it? Nah, Benton's too lazy for crime. The extra work would kill him. 
Hmm. Last time I asked him to check the Automex, the whole head told me he couldn't help because he was dead. Is he dead? Brain dead, maybe. But no, no. My point is that if you think the Automex are a lead, you'll have to check on them yourself. Hmm. Hopefully, you're mechanically inclined. Um, what is, what's the cool Brit Bane stealing? That's the weird part. There's no pattern, far as I can tell. The thefts don't make sense. I ask you, who would steal a handful of Spacer's Choice Sabers so dull they can barely cut mud, but leave the spectrum black? Ugh. Who'd be desperate enough to want to steal a Spacer's Choice Saber, full stop? That's rich people. Just out of boredom. Ah... <sighs> Sounds like our perp's not fencing the stolen goods. Yeah, probably not. No one's dumb enough to think Spacer's Choice Sabers are worth half a damn. Then there's the most recent theft. Five boxes of pens and a couple of sodas. I can't decide which one's sadder. Oh, yeah, it's just someone bored. It's both. Both are sadder. <laughs> Maybe our perp is desperately low on ink. Oh, there are two, there are even two. Oh, there are two lines for that. I wish they hadn't stolen the blue pens. We can never keep enough of those in stock. So they are valuable. An idea why someone would want to buck Cedric's office? Maybe they're keen on cashing out and want to go as painfully as possible. I don't know. Buskin Cannon's office is where he holds most of his meetings with important folks like Miss Helen. Just about oh. all negotiations happen in his office, too. Vendor pricing, major purchase orders, rentals for construction projects, you name it. Oh, before I forget, I figured you might want to access my terminal, so I had a spare keycard made. It's all yours. Anything on there I should know about? Nudes? Oh, no. I forgot to delete all of those incriminating messages I sent about which cargo to steal. Nah. I do have a list of cargo that's gone missing, though, if that helps any. Ah, oh, take it back. You're nice. Is that your terminal? Heck! Oh, I hacked it anyways. It's probably not a terminal. Oh, god damn uh, my... Can't figure out those terminal... No, 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 I'm not gonna steal it. Those terminal... Message system. Is it in here? Why do I need to go out? It's insane how quickly you get first in this game. I mean, it's realistic. Let's say it's realistic. Just like, uh, like in real life. Ah. What's in there, you're wondering? An ESN glutamine routine shake. Is it glutamine in? No, it's not glutamine. It's not good to me. What's the other thing? Damn it! What I mean is something else than what I was thinking about. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Inspector, this loading auto mechanicals programming does not match factory default settings. The standard defensive protocol has been modified to include an additional trigger. That's gonna shoot me. Define standard defensive protocol. For type K19 cargo transport auto mechanicals, defensive protocol is triggered by attempted interference with cargo or its transportation or attempted destruction of the unit. Once triggered, defensive protocol targets the perpetrator and applies lethal force until the target has been deceased for a minimum of three minutes. It's gonna deck us. Scan for signs of unusual behavior. Auto mechanical maintenance records indicate this particular unit is frequently reported as out of position or missing for periods of time. Ah, going for smoke breaks. Identify the new trigger. There is a directive in place to initiate defensive protocol should an unsanctioned data log installed in this auto mechanical be removed. Let's have a look inside the auto mech. Which means we're gonna kill it. Steer from it. Oh, 
Oh boy. Auto mechanical unit K14 is fully operational at 99% power. Please designate the cargo to be transported and its destination. How can this auto mechanical assist you? That was kind of cursed. It just looking towards me. Inspiration, really? I have that. Pavati, think you could disable the failsafe? You got it, Cap. Failsafe hey. successfully disabled. Kill mode deactivated. Aww. Disable the failsafe myself, too. Failsafe successfully disabled. Kill mode deactivated. Double the XP. Ah, oh, I guess I didn't trust Pavati after all. Mash all the buttons and hope one of them does what you want. Ejecting data log 17C. View the most recently audited data log. Okay, no worse line. Looks like the automaker has instructions to skin random cow every one to four days. Oh, that's because I have to say it. What it was in shipment 6875. Apologies. This unit does not have access to cargo inventory lists. Unit entering standby mode. Have a nice day. Damn, you talk too slow. Oh no, boy, you never shut up. Damn it, this is actually detective work now. Did I hear someone moan? Oh no, boy, you never shut up. I don't know where this leads me. Ooh. But I like the visuals because it's red, you know. Right. Now back to, to his room. Not gonna squeeze in here with me, Eddie. Okay. I want mine as well. Oh. Very secret. Tensy. Secret tensy. No good. Full of secret and tense. That's secret tensy. <laughs> yep, yeah, it's official. I made a new word up. I'm an artist, I can do that. Secret tensy. You heard it here first. Inspector. To what do I owe the pleasure? Hmm. I solved your cargo skimming issue, did I? Ooh, I love this part. The big reveal. So tell me, what happened? <laughs> I don't know. Ah. Uh... Don't get too excited. I don't know who the cool Brit is. Well, that is disappointing. I know. Still, you said you've determined how the theft is occurring? Engineering. Somebody piped us to loading max security system and revived them to skin ran skim random goods. It was Wolves. It was Spencer Wolves. Damn. You're good. Hacking the Automax. So that was our skimmer's game. But why? Everything that was stolen has seemed random. I certainly see no pattern. The theft was random except for a single shipment. So, our culprit had something specific they wished to acquire and used the random theft as a smokescreen. I must say, Inspector, you've done excellent work on this case. Then that just leaves how the culprit knew where their true target would be, or indeed... That slug would soon possess it. What? <laughs> oh, <laughs> why not sneak? Check your pocket. Okay, that's very impressive. <laughs> Don't ever touch me again. Mm. Am I right to think what you found in my office earlier was the other half of this listening device? Sure was. Let's just check. 19 minutes, not too bad. Test! Oh, everything's working. Yeah, looks good. Sure was, and whoever this itself belongs to, device belongs to, and that's our culprit. Not quite, Inspector. That listening device belongs to me. I lent it to Halcyon Helen to assist her with role research. And she used it to research slug shipments instead. Unbelievable. I helped her. Gave her whatever she needed. I thought we were doing each other a good turn. You helped to make money for slack, you mean? As though Helen herself didn't profit from her work. Please, this is a betrayal, Inspector. 
I do not take betrayal lightly. Mm -hmm. Helen should consider herself very lucky indeed that she is already among the dead. And that some other bastard beat me to putting her in the ground. Mm. Dumb. Nobody put her in the ground. She was on the grand ballroom floor, man. I'm going to pretend you're joking. My point, metaphor aside, is that the woman is already dead. If I'd known Helen was stealing from me, I may very well have killed her, or had her killed. Alas, I did not. What a good alibi. Ah. And, or maybe you did know, and this is all a show for my benefit. Oh, that is good, Inspector. Now you are thinking in the manner you must, if you intend to get to the bottom of this mess. I wish you luck with your investigation, though I doubt you'll need it. You'll find Helen's murderer. I'm confident of that. Oh, I'm sneak him out. If you'll excuse me, I must find a way to excise my anger that minimally damages my business empire. I expect it will involve shooting quite a lot of guns. Yeah, wanna come with me? I would take you as a new sidekick. I'm gonna replace... Yeah, never mind. Never mind. Oh, that's the booze room. Cool, cool. And I need a toast. A sandwich. And a toast in my life. I can't believe it's not boost. Are we actually fully done here? Can't be. Okay. Porto Administrator Ludvico. Really? So nothing else down here. Is this all just talking so? I'd hide the body in one of those crates. No one would find it for years. For years, I tell you. That was anticlimactic as hell. You tell me there's nothing else here. Okay, cool. Let's then do that stuff. That's can I please fast travel into the penthouse suit? Front entrance, damn it. Nope, nope. Damn it, and I'm gonna do it the old fashioned way. Nope. Penthouse, there we go. Oh! More talking. Anything to say? I call the big bed. Hmm. Anyone wants to challenge me, we can play a hand of cards. Inspector, I've just received word that Constable Keen is dead. Please tell me it isn't true. It is, though. He was murdered in the office. Halcyon Helen, Leora Blossom, Maria Keen. There's a murderer on the loose, Inspector. You must stop them. I don't have Maria to count on anymore, so I'm counting on you. You probably should hire someone else to... Whoever, whoever murdered here used the needler. The needler was among Helen's belongings. Whoever stole it must have been able to slip in and out of the hotel. Maria was my sole representative in Cedric's territory. The entire hotel staff is on his payroll. Any one of them could have killed her on his behalf. They were working together. Was she important to you? Maria devoted her entire life to our vision. She was absolutely committed to our company, to our project. I promised myself I'd reward her after we launched Spectrum Brown. I'd make sure she was comfortable for the rest of her life. She was also our voice of reason. She was sensible, and I appreciated her advice. I never got to tell her that. Uh, she is. That's actually deep. Ah. <sighs> Enough talk, I'll find whoever did this. Make them suffer, Inspector. Suffer? I looked into Cedric. Closely, I trust. Tell me what you found. He's playing me like a fiddle. Ah, he's a criminal boss. I can't trust anything, he says. Smart. Nothing Cedric says in his defense can be taken in good faith. Hmm. With that in mind, do you think Cedric was responsible for Helen's death? I actually think he might play his part. Mm. Mm. He 
was torturing a guy at the time of Helen's death, I can't see past that alibi. Fair enough, Inspector. I won't try to influence your judgment any more than I already have. Unfortunately, even I don't have the authority to detain Cedric. His line of work is dangerous, though. There's always a chance for an accident. Mm. Sorry to disappoint you, Ludvico. He's alive and well. Well, I'm glad to hear that. I've already lost Dr. Blossom and Constable Keen, but at least Cedric's alive. The universe is a just place. place. I like spoke of fry at the end of every sentence. And damn it, I need to sleep, eat, and drink again. Oh, that must be a oh, nice painting. By the way, I... No, oh, that's my ship. I started putting out some paintings of mine as t-shirt and paintings and stuff and clothing onto red bubble. I should start to link that in my description. Nothing of the outer worlds yet. And sadly, sadly, I am not allowed to use any Star Wars content on red bubble. The Psycho Frontier seems to be okay so far. So maybe the outer worlds will also be okay since Fallout is a lot. There's a lot of Fallout stuff on there, so should be good. Ah, uh, mm, no, no, May, yes, yes, yes. We do have a lot of science weapons at the moment. <sighs> so much sleeping and talking. Ah, I'm dedicated to finish this, finishing this DLC and game today, so I can deinstall it for that's the food for Trepang, and focus on that from now on. Okay, speak with Bella Bones region. Yes, yes, I'm gonna continue with those two. Nyoka would be interesting too, by the. Yeah. If it's brown, drinking down. So, Red Bubble, if you don't know them, they give artists a chance to put their art on t shirts, posters, caps, dresses, <laughs> mini rocks, damn it, what's, what's the English word? Skirts. <laughs> and I, I got some weird designs that I've put on skirts. It's actually kind of funny. I have only put eight of my drawings, so I'll... yeah, it's mostly drawings so far onto skirts and shirts and paintings. Some of them are quite cool looking. Some of them are ridiculous. Can I go over there now? This seems like a dead end, so probably not here, right? Oh hell yeah, I can. Yeah, but it takes a long time to upload there, just like with everything else. People underestimate how much time you need to put into descriptions and uploading and how long that actually takes, especially if there's a fail error message at the end, which is annoying as hell. Oh shit. White two professionals. Well, here come the bird army. Where's my LMG? Don't need to aim. Just spin, spin, brain, not spraying brain. Yep, today's a day like that where I mispronounce everything. The hell is going on here? Do you hear that? Bellhop owns. It's thrilling. Ah yes, I see. That looks like a cool little dungeon. Okay, what does the quest line say then now? Found Spencer. Uh, no. Damn it. 
Now I need to go back then. I just want to be your friend. Oh, but no. That seems like a waste of company ammo. That hurts my ears too. And holy hell, do they have health? Nice hit. Ooh. It just took a backflip. Don't mess with us. That's a weird place. Maybe the side quest is in here. The one that I just no need to go back for. Maybe the side quest is here. Rock to ring host. So okay. Interesting. That thing is cool. And now there's no music. Uh, and it's kind of too silent. Workbench. I'm guessing this thing will need to be repaired off. Now that's the guy, probably. Worker. No, it's just a worker. He's just sleeping. Right, Pavadi. He's taking a nap. Short circuit. Hmm. That actually had some high numbers. Where is it? Show me the gun. Short circuit. It's ah, that doesn't look too bad. It's a nice electric shotgun. Tinker it up. Tinker it up. Where's the short circuit? Yeah, that's... We're shotgunning now. Yay! Ah, I need to run back. That hurts me the most. The hell? Nothing. The... Yeah. Yeah. That's a long way too. Damn it, just skip forward 30 seconds. I'm serious. Mm. Okay, okay. Not okay. Fritz! Is that actually the worker's name? Oh, god damn it. Can I fast travel there? No, I cannot. Ah. That's not leading me where I wanted to go. But I guess we can investigate right now. And then I will go there to the new spot, to the wilderness in the next part. You know? There's nothing quite here, marker. Maybe it's downwards. There's an entrance. I can go down. See what's up with Fritz. Are you Fritz? No. Nice. Hmm. Ah, now it's a schnitzel jagd. Why is there someone red on the map? Who was the person who gave us the other quest? A guy named Spencer. God. 
Spencer. No? There must be a Spencer here. So Spencer is killing me. Is it you? No, it's not you. Just... Spencer Woolrich. Oopsie. Yeah, that's... What floor would you like to visit? VIP. No. I won't see him. He's not there. I checked. Okay, Spencer. I don't know what you did wrong, but you did wrong. Please. Can't you see my... Ask me anything. I've learned a thing or two about activities in the hotel. Oh, have you now? Please do go on. Uh, uh, don't leave me in suspense. I've security footage of you tampering with Helen's last meal. Tampering? No, no, no. I just happened to be passing through the kitchen and saw a dish that looked good. If being hungry is a crime, you better indict three-fourths of Halcyon. Ah, so quick question. What was it you wanted with a pitotorari bile gland? What? Oh, that damn bellhop promised discretion. Mm -hmm. Well, if you must know, it's um, an appetite suppressant. How do you think I keep my form so lithe? Terror ray glands keep me from feeling hunger pangs. Oh, God. If the gland was an appetite suppressant, you wouldn't be hungry if you took it. Oh, uh, well, there's... Maybe I just wanted to see what was in it. Oh, la, what a pathetic defense. As it so happens, I may not have had the terror egg gland acquired for personal use. Uh, I may have placed it in Bellamy's meal. But uh. before you indict me, please, just listen. I wasn't trying to kill her. Talk. I will. I will. Terror ray glands aren't supposed to be lethally poisonous. They're supposed to cause extreme lethargy, as if you'd inhaled several quarts of Spectrum vodka. She would have had to eat six or seven of the glands to die, and even then it would be an extended, arduous process. So you tried to get her drunk? Ah... Uh... Why poison her at all? I was just getting to that. I only wanted her to be incapacitated during the brown unveiling. With her out of commission, the next available celebrity, myself, would get to host the unveiling. Please think twice about telling the administrator of my misdeeds. If he learns the truth, what's left of my career will be left in shambles. Hmm. Why should I not tell him? Oh. I'm telling him the truth about what happened. What will happen when all of the great actors are gone, Inspector? Who will replace us? No one. That's who. There will be nothing on the Aether Waves but serials starring mechanicals. I hope it's worth it. Ah, oh, there will always be new actors. Well, I will fill you all, man. I almost can talk fluidly without an accent. What almost. What would you like to visit? Ah. <sighs> Fantastic. the finest seat in the Ah, too short. The elevator music was too short. Okay, talking to him again. Inspector? Ludwig? Uh, I've completed my investigation in Helen's poisoning. Excellent. I trust you have a name for our poisoner. Yes. Spencer Woolrich confessed to the crime. Oh, I am disappointed. I'd always believed Mr. Woolrich a man of high character. It pains me to order the arrest and detention of someone I admired. Mm. I'd like you to continue investigating Helen's murder. You've found the poisoner, but her killer remains at large. Uh, do I? 
Um, I don't think I do. I know who killed Halston Helm. Are you confident you've finished your investigation? You've questioned all your suspects. No, no. I don't, I don't. I don't see why I should know that yet. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to the wilderness. Ne. How? How? Okay, I was there. I was there. Oh, I need to sneeze. Oh, see ya before it's too late. Oh.